This is the daily whiteboard. This is your day-to-day -day go to spot for scheduling. Here you can move stuff around easily between crew to crew, and it gives you sort of a one day picture of what's going on for each crew on a given day. Up here, I've got the date and which crews I want to show. And you can choose whether you want to show event sizes as relative or not. If I turn this on, it's going to make jobs that take longer bigger and jobs that don't take very long less. Or I can turn it off and I can just see small tiles for everything. This is a lot easier to move things around when you're just looking at small tiles. Across the top here, I can see that each crew in my company has its own column. Underneath each column is the number of man hours and crew hours scheduled for each crew. So here I can see install A crew and three tells me that's a three person crew. They've got nine hours worth of work scheduled for them. So does install B. Lawn crew A on the other hand only has five hours and 17 minutes worth of work scheduled based on the jobs I've added to them. So I could fill a blank there. Luckily over here, I've got something over and unassigned. So I can just click this job and drag it over here and drop it. Now it's gonna add thick and square to Lawn Crew A's route. Now that I've added it, I wanna make sure they're still doing it in the most efficient driving order. So you can hit the optimize routes button. Simply click the crew that you wanna optimize and the starting and ending location for this crew and then optimize it. It'll go out and generate the best directions for those sites, site by site, and when I save the changes, it's gonna reorder the jobs on that date in the proper order. That way, when the crew goes out in the field and they click start their timesheet from a schedule, it'll show them these sites that have been scheduled for them in the order they're supposed to do them. I can also print crew dailies from the daily whiteboard. A crew daily report, if I run it for line crew A, looks something like this. Every site they're supposed to do shows up on the route along with the address and what the task is. If I've set specific notes for any given day, they'll also show up here on their report. And on the right-hand side, it's giving me a total man hours estimated for the job, how many have been used to date, how many are left, and what today's goal is based on the duration of the schedule. So here I'm seeing that I haven't done any work on this site yet, it's probably my first time out, but my goal is to get this cut down in one hour and 14 minutes. And that's done in crew hours based on the size of the crew that you've scheduled for that day. You can either print these crew dailies and hand them out to your crews or they're PDFs. You can email them to the foreman if it's easier.